time yet? Nearly. Nearly is. All right. Good day, YouTube. Alicia, Rhino. Black Creek Brewing Company's Stout. It is 5% alcohol. It is a stout brewed at the Black Creek Brewing Company in Toronto, Ontario. This is the historic brewery that you can visit in the Black Creek Pioneer Village. Everything in this brewery is done the same way it would have been done in the 1800s. So it's all wood and copper equipment. It's all fire brewed. It's completely old school. Yes, old school. And the brewmaster even wears the old school pioneer like outfits since you know you can go and visit them. That's intense. I mean, it's capped just like it would be in the 1800s. It Thank wouldn't you. be capped. I was just gonna say. <laughs> I was just gonna say. Hmm. Looks like a stout. Nice bubble. Smells extremely stoutish, like it should. Coffee, chocolate, caramel, toffee. Very rich, extremely um, rich. I don't get any molasses on it, which sometimes you get on a stout. I don't get the, like the mochaccino smell, so it's not like the chocolate and the coffee is mixed very well. But it does smell nice. It smells very stoutish, as, as Alicia said. I think that's pretty smooth for a stout. There's like hardly any bitterness. I didn't smell it. I was expecting to taste it, but I didn't taste hardly any bitterness at all. See, I taste wow. some coffee bitterness, but I hate coffee, so I always get it when I there's coffee in there. Yeah, see, I I'm not a coffee drinker, but I don't mind coffee, and I was expecting it to just taste way more bitter. It's pretty good. There is some nice chocolatey notes at the front. There are some nice caramelly notes at the front. It actually is a fairly well-rounded stout. I wasn't expecting that. Especially for something that, you know, isn't made with machinery. Yeah. No, you're so right. All the flavors are at the front. Then everything is just <laughs> easy drinking on the way down. Definitely. Wow. I know that this is a, a hand-pumped cask-conditioned stout at the brewery. And... I think minusing a little bit more of the carbonation before it was bottled and it was held in, mm -hmm. it would be amazing. You know what? Yeah, definitely. Definitely, I hear that too. Luckily, there's a, a little bit left for James or he might cry. He needed to recover from that other one. Hardcore. No, this is actually not a bad stout. I'm not even a fan of stouts, but this one is, is not so bad. See, and I love like stouts, it. and I still like this. Uh, again, as I said, if, if I got it on tap, hand-pumped out of a cask... It would have so been different. a little bit more of the carbonation had vanished, it would have been amazing. Yes, definitely. Here, it is good. I would give it a solid 8 out of 10 right now. I'll give it a 7.25 for myself. There you go. Somebody that doesn't really like stouts, give it a great mark. Exactly. Done. Black Creek Brewing Company's stout. You can cut it now. I think we're done. <laughs>